Hey everyone, hope you're doing well. This is your favorite media communications specialist, Aaron Haney, coming at you from the Our Lady of Guadalupe Courtyard. As you can see, I am, yeah, soaking up all of the last fun of this summer. This fall begins this next week, so uh, pretty crazy. I don't know about you, but I am definitely ready for some cooler weather after the hottest summer ever. <laughs> so uh, I've been uh, away the last few weeks. Um, if you couldn't tell by my shirt, uh, I went to Disney World for the first time. It was awesome. It was the 50 year anniversary of Disney World, which is great. Uh, also, unfortunately, I got COVID. So that was not fun having to isolate and quarantine in Florida. So, but nevertheless, uh, here I am back yet again. Uh, not even COVID could keep me from returning. Anyways, there has been a lot that has been happening in the past couple of weeks and honestly in the past couple of months. And I just wanted to go ahead and make this video to address some of those changes and some of those things that are happening with you. So without further ado, come along with me. All right, so since we're outside, why don't we go ahead and get one of the first and probably one of the first things that you notice different about our parish out of the way, which is the new fence line that was created as part of an Eagle Scout project for Richard Zanny. You guys may remember back in early July, uh, Richard was asking for donations. Well, thank you so much for all who contributed. It was actually able to be brought to fruition. And here it is, check it out. Here we are in the church and I have two awesome changes that I'm super excited to tell you about. The first one is in our parish chapel. We have actually replaced the upholstery in the pews uh, for the seats and on the kneelers. So now they are brand spanking new, have a beautiful maroon crimson color, uh, which is perfect. So if you haven't come, Come and check it out. They are a lot more comfier than they used to be in the past. Now, the next change, probably one of the biggest changes you may have noticed, is that we now have a tabernacle in the church. So in the church itself, Father Scott has added a tabernacle, um, which is amazing because now Jesus is able to actually reside with us uh, in the same sanctuary during Mass, which is just amazing. So uh, more details about this are to come in future. So please be on the lookout. Hopefully we'll get an explanation from Father Scott where he can go more into detail about why this is important and why we went ahead and made this update. Okay, and so while I was actually in here, I actually <laughs> totally forgot that we even have new statues. So we have new statues of Jesus uh, and Joseph and uh, Jesus and Mary. Those are in the chapel and uh, the Jesus with the most sacred heart of Jesus and Our Lady of Guadalupe are now here in the church. So I had just completely forgotten about that. So please forgive me. Again, so much has happened uh, in the last few weeks. So yeah, let's go ahead and get some footage of that too.
All right, so here we are back in the office. Sorry for the weird angle. One of the little stoppers on the leg of the tripod came off somewhere when we were filming all of that. And uh, there's so many places we cover it. It's just too hard to tell. So hopefully, uh, you know, St. Anthony of Padua, pray for us. <laughs> Maybe we'll find it. Uh, maybe we'll just have to order a new tripod. But as you can see, there have been a lot of changes here in the last few weeks, the last few months. Um, I know I've been saying that over and over again, uh, but truly there have been as well. It's been busy here on our end, of course, on the communications team. We recently did our communication survey and we are still currently in the works on getting those results out to you and also you know meeting with father scott and the rest of the staff to kind of put the results from that survey into action what we did with this survey is we wanted to get input we wanted to get feedback so that it could help guide us in the future and guide how we move and what we do anyways thank you so much for watching this video please stay tuned for more in the next coming months we have a lot planned, so be ready, and we'll catch you next time. Peace. All right. Some loving had me a blast. Some loving happened so fast.